Hello my dear friends, welcome to Nurses Ladder. So today in this video, I came with a specific topic which was requested by many of my viewers and subscribers. So uh, the topic is nothing but uh, about the IELTS requirement and the OET requirement for overseas nurses um, for NMC in the United Kingdom. So before moving into the video, I would like to request that if there is anyone who is new to my channel and also who is interested to watch videos related to nursing education as well as nursing profession, then you can better subscribe to my channel. And at the same time, you have to press the bell icon for getting notifications related to new videos. So my dear friends, let's start this video. So before moving into the details of this video, I would like to uh, give you some keywords. Uh, you might be knowing about this even though I would like to share this. So the first word which I would like to introduce here is NMC. So the full form of NMC is Nursing and Midwifery Council. This is a registration council for nurses, all the registered nurses in the United Kingdom. So in order to get registered with this particular nursing council, you are supposed to uh, complete certain language requirements as well as you need to pass certain test or you need to pass certain competency test in your subject field that is nursing. So uh, here I'm going to talk only about the language requirements that is the English language requirements which includes two different tests. The first one is IELTS and the second one is OET. So let's see what is IELTS. IELTS full form is International English Language Testing System and OEET is Occupational English Test. So in order to become a registered nurse um, in under uh, NMC of the United Kingdom, you are supposed to complete or fulfill certain English language testing system criteria. So let us see in detail what are those criteria uh, by which you can complete or clear so that you can become a registered nurse and start working in the United Kingdom. So the first one is about IELTS. As you all know, IELTS uh, includes both academic as well as general testing. So for uh, nurses, specifically any of the nurses who wants to work in the United Kingdom uh, under work visa, you're supposed to complete the academic IELTS testing. So uh, under this, uh, specifically there are four modules. The first one is reading, second listening, third writing, and the fourth one is speaking. So in this testing, you're supposed to achieve a band score, overall band score of seven, in which you're supposed to get an individual band score of 6.5 in writing module, and seven in all other three modules that is reading, listening and speaking. Here NMC has made it easy for the candidates uh, by uh, helping them through combination of uh, two different uh, tests, IELTS test. So they can combine the scores of two different IELTS um, test and they can um, club those scores and they can try for applying for registration in NMC. So according to this rule, the candidate has to sit for these two tests within six months period. The first and the second test um, interval would be within six months. Uh, in both of these tests, none of the scores, that is none of the four scores must not go below 6.5. So it must be at least 6.5 in all the four modules. That is 6.5 is the minimum score. So if you take uh, the first test and the second test, minimum at least you should have uh, got 6.5 in all the four. This is all about IELTS scoring. Now let's see about OET. So OET is Occupational English Test. So this is another option for all those nurses who want to apply for registration under NMC. So according to this, again, uh, the, the modules are same, 
but the bank scores would be in the form of uh, alphabets like uh, minimum um, the candidate must get C plus uh, which must be in writing module and all the other three modules you can get B overall the score would be B so again uh, in OET also there is an option for combining the different scores um, of each modules in two different cities within six months period so my dear friends don't get confused don't worry at all uh, you have to visit the website, official website of Nursing and Midwifery Council, United Kingdom. So the official website address is nmc.org.uk. So you can visit this website and you can find the English language requirements for applying for registration under the NMC that is in United Kingdom. So my dear friends, that's for today. I hope this video was useful for you. If you really like this video, you can press uh, the like button and also you can subscribe to my channel for getting more, more videos like this. So thank you so much for watching. Take care and bye-bye.